Hello, movie lovers, and welcome to CML Theater Movie Review, home of independent films. <laughs> I'm so fucking pissed off. I don't even know where to start. I'm just so fucking angry. I'm so upset. And this movie, I felt like a part of my life was taken away from me. And we about to get into that right here on CML Entertainment. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Moth. Man, this has to be one of one of the worst films of this year alone. I am completely pissed off right now. Mm -hmm. When you watch a film like this, and it just reminds you of how many minutes of your day that it took away from you, you can't get those minutes back. Mm -hmm. But see, this is why I do this for you guys. So you won't have to waste your goddamn minutes. Mm -hmm. The movie was directed... <laughs> By Jergo Elkis, Elgis, um, Joseph Gallery, and Joseph, and also written by Joseph Gallery. All right, when the film first started off, I enjoyed the beginning of this film. Okay, because I like how when the film starts off, you see, you hear this woman breathing heavily, which you can tell that she was already fucked up in the head, but then something dragged her a good little feet in the grass and then she still had the camera with her but then something picked up by her throat and choked her out which is it sounded like it picked up by her throat but we never really got to see what the hell it was and then you see this woman you know she's teaching class and she's you know teaching all her classmates about rather the myth between if it's a myth or is it real between the Mothman or whatever and I think the movie that the movie that celebrated that the best way, I think the movie that creeped me out with the Mothman prophecies. Remember that? With Richard Gere? Oh, yeah. That movie was freaky as shit. I like that movie. I thought that movie was really good. And I like how um, everybody um, did that film. But this film, it just did not deliver at all. And when you talk about boredom, oh, my God. Don't even get me fucking started. <laughs> Listen, that wolf pussy that was on my face a couple days ago. <laughs> <laughs> was a lot more scary than this film man I wanted to fuck it I didn't know which one I wanted to take out I didn't know if I wanted to take myself out for watching the damn movie or take out the people that's in the movie because I swear like the whole time you just be hoping like See, please somebody to swoop down and kill these motherfuckers <laughs> so we can get on with our lives but that didn't really happen and now I'm just tired of these wannabe found footage Dragged out pieces of man, let's get a shit already, shall we? I give this movie a big ass, big ass disappointment. Oh no, what we do this time? These people clearly don't know what the fuck horror is. I mean, I mean, it's a slow burn, like you know, like the Blair Witch Project, the original. I had that slow burn. But then it was just so satisfying and rewarding by the end. By the time you get to the end of this movie. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all can see I'm pissed off. It's hard. It's it just, oh my God. This movie is like, oh my God, it's terrible, man. It is terrible. And it is slow burn. Like the girl keeps saying, oh, did you hear that? I hear a clicking sound. You hear that? <laughs> <laughs> there was no clicking sound. Oh my God, did you see that in the bushes? Look over there. In the bullshit, I'm like, oh my god, like we had to, we had to run it back <laughs> <laughs> to see if anybody was in the bushes. There was nobody there. No, it wasn't. There, I mean, you at least could have put like somebody with a cutout covers with the cutout <laughs> eyes or something in damn bushes, man. And then the, you see the cover. You see the cover behind me. You see how the, the thing look all like jeepers creep up and shit. You think that's in the movie? <laughs> <laughs> don't waste your time on this motherfucking shit. Listen, I did the suffering for you. Don't even bother. If if don't, okay. Mm -hmm. This is why I do this. Do not touch this movie. This is a high recommendation. Don't waste your goddamn time because I'll tell you, if you watch this movie and you sit next to your loved one, you might want to strangle them because you'll get confused. You might want to kill them or you might want to kill the people on the TV and you can't kill them because they ain't a the motherfucking TV. You can find this film right now on Amazon. I I just don't bother. Please no, don't bother. Nope. Don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget <laughs> to hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to leave a comment. Let me know what you think about this god awful film. Because I told you I thought about it. Huge waste of time. 
it, it's an hour and twenty something minutes, but that's 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 you can't get that back. And see, I, I lost that hour and twenty minutes, me and my family, and we can't get that back. <laughs> so maybe we'll take someone else hour and twenty minutes from their life and get theirs. <laughs> and to all my movie loves. <laughs> I love you. <laughs>